Crikey, there she is, Australia's own phone, the Kogan Agora 9. Oh, looks like she's evolved from last year. Oh, whoa there, buddy. Boy, you're a popular little fella, aren't you? Must have been flying off the shelf when you landed here. Now, I always recommend caution before handling a brand new phone. Always make sure to check the markings. Oh, well, crikey. Now that's something I can handle. Come on there, buddy. Let's get you home. Let's get you home. Come on. There you go. Oh, is this a mating call? G'day, mate. <laughs> yeah, I'm a bit busy. It was a mate. Uh, cool. Hey everyone, I'm Sam Tucker and today we are having a look at the Kogan Agora 9. Thank you very much Kogan for sending this one in. The people have been asking for it. I'm guessing that might have something to do with this uh, being a certain type of phone known as affordable. It's no secret that the big boys out there are increasing their flagship phone prices by a factor of a Kogan Agora 9. So let's get right into it. Of course, you can unlock it with the fingerprint sensor right on the bottom. And just like most of us, it will automatically detect if you put a finger on its butt. First of all, what are the cameras like? Let's try it out. I think both the cameras are the same, but here's a little selfie shot of myself. It'd be weird if it was a selfie shot of someone else, wouldn't it? Let's turn it onto harder mode. Of course, video. This is what video looks like. But then again, we are in the same time studio with perfect lighting. So uh, tell you what, let's head on out to the outback again uh, to give it a real Aussie test out there, yeah. All right, crikey, if you're gonna do your own adventure vlog, this is what it looks like with the front facing camera and pointing at an absolute idiot. So someone behind me, it must, must be the person I was behind me I was referring to. Wanna have a look, this is the rear camera now. I don't know, I'm pretty sure it's the same sensor on both sides, but th th this is what it will look like if you're using the rear camera. But if you put it in a little carrier here and keep it still, well, then you can get real with life and what it's all about. Chicken. Oh, a bit of seasoning. Oh, I'm hungry. Here's some more sample photos from outside. Now these are untouched. Yes, I do actually look that good. Okay, so it seems to work all right if you have plenty of good light. You might have some troubles in low light, but luckily you do get a flash on the front and the back. So you can flash yourself. Although you know that does show the discrepancy between the 1% and the rest of us. You know, Kogan can front flash and it's a feature. I do it, I get jail time. Don't worry about it. Well, speaking of the survival environment, let's see if we can survive a round of PUBG. Again, this is an affordable phone. It's not really made for gaming, but it's worth a shot, why not? All right, I will play as Markiplier. Don't know how to put his pants on. Won't worry about it. Okay, and as you'd expect, playing PUBG is a little bit choppy on the thing. It's like we're playing on an Xbox or something. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome back, back to the eSports with Sam Time on the Akogan Agora 9. He's unstoppable. Yeah, boy. And he ain't gonna let a few lost frames per second stop him from dominating the map. Welcome to the party. Sorry, sorry. Do you not have the power of the Kogan on your side? I see. And with that kill, this is now a 1v1 situation. Can the Agora get him over the line? Oh, yes. He's done it, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, he's won with the Kogan. The power of the Kogan, number one out of 100. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the Kogan. Get one today. If you want to be an elite player, you get yourself one of these Kogans. Turns out you don't need frame rate to be the best. All you need is skill and the brand name. Sponsor my eSport league now. Unfortunately, Fortnite's installer doesn't even let you try to run the game, except it is, thankfully, uh, compatible with the more popular Battle Royale, RuneScape. All right, let's try out watching some video now. It's a, it's quite a nice looking screen. Yes, the phone does have a 3.5 mil headphone jack and even comes with a special pair of Kogan in-ear earbuds. Ah, which I kind of wish were out of my earbuds, but hey, they'll do in a pinch. They've got a microphone on it as well. Luckily though, you don't actually need headphones to watch a Marley Cyrus music clip. Oh, crikey. Ooh. Ah, okay, uh, where were we? Interestingly, the speaker for this is actually on the back. So if you're one of those people who listen to their speakers while on public transport and you're worried that you might not annoy everyone, 
Now you can be safe. You'll be the most popular person on the train. Oh, well, 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 order me some fish and chips because this phone is compatible with dim sims. What a classic. In fact, it's such a classic that the second sim only works with 2G, which means it doesn't work even on Kogan's own mobile network. But hey, I'm just being a little bit cheeky like Miley Cyrus a few seconds ago. <clears throat> because you can actually put an SD card in there because it's compatible with expandable storage, just like my face. Oh, but let's get real. This phone is $1,000 cheaper than the iPhone XR. And the main difference you'll get between this and an iPhone is of course the camera and if you really wanna play games. But for everything else, podcasts, music, YouTube, anything, a phone like this can do it all. Oh, and let me just say that if you want a camera, you can get plenty of great cameras for far less than the $1,000 difference between this and the iPhone. Like the great Canon G7X, and those things can sync up with your phone. So unless you really need Fortnite on your phone, I'd definitely recommend checking out the Kogan phone. Link in the description. Full disclosure, this is a sponsored video, but I'm being honest, I'm always quite surprised with what freaking these phones can do for such a price compared to the big boys, which cut charge an arm and a leg. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you on the next one. And until then, Sam Tucker saying, stay funky, everyone. Sam time, signing off, crikey. Oh, what a bargain, what value for money, it's a crikey. Subscribe today. Oh, I'm just speaking about value for money. I didn't actually get this on camera, but this comes with its own little screen protector because I peeled this off, off camera. This is the, the one that every sort of phone has that you peel off. I should have got it on camera. I should have uploaded it to my second Ask Mr. Channel. Oh, it's ASMR. Sorry. Funk it down. Big, beautiful, vibrant screen. Let's cut right to the chase. I know you all want to see me on the chase. And then there were two. And then they were crouching when I didn't mean to. Four alive. I've killed seven. They call me the greatest.